is Tuesday the 6th of April and this morning I have a reduced fat croissant for Marks and Spencers for 154 calories and then on the side I've got an orange that I've just sliced up and it's still got the peel on so I weighed it with the peel and it's 236 grams for 64 calories. So that's my breakfast this morning. And I'll catch you at lunchtime. I'm out and about now shopping and I'm starving hungry. So I'm going to try one of these. Never tried them before. Just got it from B&M. So it's 220 calories. And it's now, what is it, 2.30? So I'm really ready for this. Hopefully I'll enjoy it. So I've just got back from Aldi's and Morrison's. Only done a tiny bit in Morrison's. So I'll just turn you around and show you what I've got. So I didn't get much in Morrison's. I just got a uh, Shreddies. That's my uh, husband's favourite cereal. Two packs of these because they all like those. Um, and these my daughter always likes. I've not had one before. What are they? 93 calories per 100 grams. And there's 125 in those. So that's that. And my favourite squash, cherries and berries. Absolutely love that. Um, some washing up liquid. I got two of those. And some semi skimmed milk. And the 5% Greek yogurt. And then this is Aldi's. So I've got a Sweetheart cabbage. That's very low in calorie cabbage. Um, the Skinny Burgers. I'm going to have the Skinny Burgers one day this week. Just two small chicken fillets. My daughter wants to make something tonight for her tea. The reduced fat garlic slices and they are three slices for 251 calories well if I had any I'd only have one so that's that um, the sweet pancakes I've told you before I can't go to Aldi's without picking these up because they all like these 163 per pancake I don't think it's worth it myself but and then some tender stem broccoli and I was excited to see as well, they had purple sprouting broccoli. I love that. Um, and I got a, a piece of beef. I always cook this in the slow cooker and it's absolutely fine. And it's just so tender. Um, and I got a head of broccoli. Again, that's low calorie. I was hoping for some British strawberries, but they didn't have any. So I've got some strawberries. And these are the sausages that I always have from there now. 76 calories per sausage. And they are delicious. Even my husband likes these. And he's fussy with sausages. Um, some skinny meatballs. And they are... Three meatballs for 117 calories. And I only ever have three, and that's plenty, I find. And the bacon, what I have... Where's the calories for this? Two rashers, two medallions for 63 calories. And I always find two is enough of that. Some caster sugar... For when my daughter bakes or I bake. Some sultanas, too bad for that because my husband and dad wants me to make them a fruitcake each. And two orange juices as per usual. I don't drink that. Um, some wet wipes and a Passata, passata, however you say it. Half a pack is 63 calories. I always put this in my spaghetti bolognese. And then I've got some mini apples. And then some jazz apples. 
And some of the large oranges. I'm finding these large oranges from Aldi is really, really nice. They're lovely and sweet and juicy. That's what I had on my breakfast this morning. Um, that's for the rabbit. Some romaine lettuce. My daughter asked for this because she's going to be doing something with... Um, she asked me to get some halloumi. I don't know quite what she's doing, but it's something with chicken halloumi and you fill the lettuce leaf up. How high is halloumi? Per 30 grams, 98. Oh, that's not too bad. That's basically about the same as brie. Um, a pack of ham. 20 calories a slice. And these, my husband loves these. They're 123 a biscuit. And I think they look quite substantial size as well for the calories. I was looking today in Aldi's for the um, almond thin biscuits that Kaza had on her channel. I'm sure she got them from Aldi's, but I couldn't find them. So I was gutted. Um, the sandwich thins that I always have, 99 calories a thin. And these brioche buns is for the skinny burgers this week. 157 a bun. Don't think that's too bad at all. And some mashed potato for my husband. Crikey, that's high. Half a pack for 199. Hmm. Minion ham, because they seem to like that. I don't know why, because it looks pretty gross to me. 31 calories a slice. Um, a pack of paracetamol. Some garlic, because we get through loads of garlic. And if we want chocolate for cooking or anything, I always buy Aldi's own. And it's so cheap. There's something like 30p a bar. And honestly, the white chocolate is delicious. And I've got two tubs of this, which is identical to clover. And this week I got some ice buns rather than custard tarts. And they're only 128 calories per finger. So I'm looking forward to having one of those shortly, I think. And the avocado. Loving avocado now. Two of the jars of pasta sauce, which we use for the meatballs. Quarter of a jar, 35 calories. So it's not too bad at all. And then I got a self raisin flour there, another cast of sugar, some hand wash, tuna, per half a can, 81 calories. Baked beans. Now, I don't bother with baked beans myself nowadays. They're so high in calories. I just, let's go around there and have a look. I just find it a waste myself. Calories, where are you? Per half a can, 84 cal um, oh, per half a can, 184 calories. I mean, that's just a waste, I think. And then medium sized eggs. But I'm always weighing these now because they 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 do catch you out. It says there's 68 per average egg, but it's always best to weigh it. Um, bread. I never have this. But what is it if I did? Which I wouldn't. 131 a slice for that. So that's everything, isn't it? Oh, I got a couple of frozen which I need to hurry up because it's going to defrost and it is defrosting and I've got curly fries and I picked up a box of this fish had it before and it's delicious and it's 263 per fillet so I enjoy that with just something simple like new potatoes or jacket potato that's a quick easy meal so that's everything I bought. I'll tell you what I spent. In Aldi's, it was a total of 67.68. And also, I had nine bottles of their uh, pop, the, you know, the dupe for Pepsi. And Morrison's was £14.43. So yeah, that's everything I bought today. 
and I'm going to go and whiz this away now. I'm absolutely starving hungry because I had a disaster of a lunch. Um, so I think I might just have a nice bun now because it's what time? Is it quarter past? It's quarter past four, so it's not worth having anything really now because it'll be tea time. So yeah, okay, I'm going to go and put it all away and I'll catch you either if I have a nice bun or I'll show you that, otherwise it'll be at tea time. This is my tea tonight. I've got one of the spinach, leek and, um, oh, I can't remember, cheddar is it? I can't remember the cheese in there, but it's 406 calories from Aldi's. If you haven't seen um, me have it before, it's absolutely delicious. I thoroughly recommend buying them. They are gorgeous. And I have got 88 grams of tender stem broccoli for 32 calories. Delicious. So I've managed to cut a tidyish piece of this, what my daughter made yesterday. Um, it comes in at 349 a piece, but I've cut the piece smaller, so I'm going to class it as 250. So I've just jumped on to end the video here, um, as um, I've let my phone go dead, so I'm charging it at the same time as videoing. Um, I'm not having a skinny whip tonight, because I had the um, the cake that my daughter made yesterday, and with that, I've only got 11 calories left, so... I'm obviously not wanting to go over calories, so I'm going to leave it as that. Um, yeah, and also I was going to tell you what I thought of the grenade bar. I won't be buying it again. I didn't like it at all. Um, I only ate half of it because I didn't like it. My daughter tried some. She liked it. My husband liked it, but it wasn't for me. So that's all I had for my lunch. But then I come home and had... I don't think I filmed it. I had a nice bun, which was 128 calories. So, yeah, so with everything else, as I say, I've only got 11 calories left, so I'm not going to have a skinny whip tonight. So, I will catch you again tomorrow. Sorry if the angle's not very good, but I'm trying to film this and uh, have it on charge. So, I will see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Bye. <laughs>